Breaking news tonight about one of Mobile's finest, an MPD officer involved in a bad crash. Yeah, it happened around 745 near the intersection of DIP and Ellen. Now, Lee Peck on the scene just minutes after all this happened. And Lee, you saw an officer in a lot of pain. Well, I did, Byron and Lenise. I want to move out the way. Still an active scene out here. You can see it appears to have been a head-on collision. Now, within the last half hour or so, uh, Mobile Police have had their drone out here getting a bird's eye view of this crash. But like you said, I was out here when the officer was being pulled from his patrol car, visibly in pain. If we could roll that video, uh, you see they have him loaded up on the gurney as they wheeled him across the street to put him into the ambulance. Uh, at this time, we, we know that he has injuries to his leg, possibly a broken leg. He's now at the hospital uh, being checked out. Another person, uh, a passenger in the other vehicle, a woman also taken away by ambulance with unknown injuries. Now airbags in both vehicles appear to have been deployed in this crash. At this time, it's unknown if the officer uh, was en route to a call. A witness that we did speak to on the scene said he did not have his lights on. It all happened real fast. And in her words, the crash was unavoidable. Take a listen. I was northbound on Dolphin Island Parkway and the police cruiser was southbound. A white car pulled directly in between us uh, and I almost hit the white car and I went up on the curb to the right and avoided the impact but there was a huge impact right in front of me and glass flew everywhere. And, and uh, the police officer, I, I parked the car and got out and I checked on the occupants of both vehicles. The police officer was pretty badly injured, uh, lower body, and uh, he was prostrate. He was conscious, but in a lot of pain. All right, Mobile Police still out here on the scene. There's that drone we were talking about getting a closer uh, view of the crash from up above. Again, a two vehicle crash involving uh, a passenger who was taken to the hospital in the other vehicle and a Mobile Police officer possibly with a broken leg. We're also getting word that wrecker trucks are on their way to the scene to haul the vehicles off where Mobile Police can finally clear the scene and get the roadway back open. If we get any new information, we'll of course pass it along to you on air and online. Reporting live tonight from DIP, Lee Peck, Fox 10 News.